Hello and welcome to What Are You Saying? Hashtag Ways, where we talk about topics in the news as it affects us all. I am Osaiwa Mesali and today I'm joined by Isia Fodile and Faith Olasande. How are you ladies doing? <laughs> hey, we are doing fine. <laughs> and you're looking radiant. You are. <laughs> Thank you very much. Tell us about it. In the midst of this coronavirus. You know, so oh, the thing oh, is, um, everybody is talking about COVID-19, COVID-19, all over the place. I just looked at my hands. I said, okay, I'm always washing my hands, washing my hands and all of that. And I looked at my nails because I had really long nails. And I looked at my nails. Inside the nail, I saw, you know, Little some small, small some dead yes. gathering and all that. I said, you know what? I called my nail enough technician yesterday. <laughs> I said, Victor, cut them off. So I cut off my nails because it's, you know, the way bacteria is all yes, high, in. you know, so let's, I think it's just hygiene consciousness, you know, and I've been doing a lot about it, you know, talking about, actually for me, I have a small business that I run on the side, you know, I'm also helping people, please, this is how you to, to keep your I business environment. I saw it environment, online today. <laughs> keep your business environment <laughs> safe because it's just, I mean, there are little, little things that you can actually do to keep yourself safe from it, you know. And this is clean. a fantastic disinfectant. Yes, so I carry it everywhere I'm going now. Yeah, in fact, we're almost like mosquitoes. <laughs> we're all ha having our hand sanitizers. It's very important. Yes, absolutely. You know? It's very important at least. Let's just do our Stay bit. safe yeah. and keep so, safe. So how are you co coping with... I have been coping very schools well. Are schools are shut down. schools have shut down. In oh, fact, yeah. yesterday was like a mad day. We woke up one mo we woke up one morning and they said, "Oh, all schools should be closed by Monday." So everybody was trying to do a thing or two to get the children ready for the long haul because we don't know when we, we are going to get back. Oh, so they didn't give you a definite. No, it's indefinite. It's, 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 it's indefinite. Wow. So hopefully, we say two weeks. That's 14, 14 days. But yes. actually, actually we're not sure yet. Yeah. It should be in a month because of the uh, self isolation Easter. and yeah. uh, okay. self distancing. So how, how about you, Faith? Well, I mean, I am doing everything that needs to be done. Wash, like guys, our hands are dry now. You're Very white. Like, <laughs> it's crazy because like every little thing, you're like, oh, wash. Let me just. It's, let me it's just. almost as if one is developing some sort of OCD. Yeah. You know, yes. Well, it's not really. You've been dirty. You lock your nose. You know, you do this, you do Ooh. that. You know, so I think this is just telling us, you know what? Let's. Let's, Let's be clean, yeah. yes. All right, right, so coronavirus has been dominating the news all month. And with the new four cases found in Lagos, um, coronavirus is changing the way we live and we work. So we are going to be dealing with that when we come back for the break. But this is what we found as today's quote. Now, work injuries and illnesses can affect every aspect of life for workers and their families. I mean, this is not injury, but... <laughs> it's going to affect. So yeah, I, I don't absolutely. know how um, employ employers are getting ready for whatever it is it. That, w that would come with all of these things happening. And the fact that um, um, we have to look at the, um, the situation with the uh, people who are supposed to be infected those that are going to be out of jobs mm -hmm. in the process bread as well. Winners. The bread, exactly, the breadwinners. Wow. So there's, it's a, it's there's a, so it's, much to, it's, you there's, know, there's a lot, yeah, to talk a lot. about. So we'll take a quick break. When we return, we'll see what we found in the news. Please stay with us.